The second big gameplay trailer is ready, going off of what we're told more recently, along with what's been revealed about the new additions to the Smiling Critters. For starters, new release dates have been thrown into the mix, connecting to what were said to be leaks, telling us that we would officially be expecting tomorrow, January 20th, to be when the Chapter 3 trailer finally gets released. A post detailing the CEO of the company putting out a sort of announcement as the CEO was the one to reveal most of the big game updates in the past. But more definitively, the official Mob Entertainment account ended up replying to these allegations and rumors recently spreading around, giving us a different release date idea from what we actually saw depicted in the image. A Twitter user asks the company, Please Mob, just tell me one word, is this real or not? as we need the official confirmation from the company itself to verify this potential trailer date, to which the company responds with, Fake bruh, what month is 20? Basically playing into the idea that they're still keeping up the lighthearted trolling they played into with the fake trailer announcement earlier on, but also that what we saw here in this image was obviously not meant to be real. But on top of that, one of the developers basically cleared up the fake news situation by telling us that the only official update is meant to come from the official mob Twitter or the news station of the Discord server for everything trailer related. Meaning we'd still need a new estimate, considering the fact that we're already nearing the 20th of the month, with still no physical trailer in sight. So here's the situation before getting into the new release date predictions. Due to the fact that the company requires time in between this second gameplay trailer drop and the official game, they physically need to be releasing this trailer for Chapter 3 within the next week or so. We were already told by the CEO of the company himself to be expecting a full game release by the end of the month in January, meaning they'd have to fit the trailer in before getting too close to the 30th. And it turns out Mob Entertainment themselves decided to give us another update on the whole situation that Fans desperately need to know about at this point, revealing a little more insight into the whole Chapter 3 trailer process before it actually comes out. First off, we wanted to say thank y'all for the patience while we prepare our final Chapter 3 trailer. We know you're excited and we can't wait to show it to you. Essentially locking in that it's supposed to be ready outside of this final touch-ups phase that we were told of, and that despite the wait time for this project surpassing what we originally expected, it's not meant to be delayed or anything past this month. We actually hear more from the team members themselves working on this big upcoming trailer, as we're told that all things considered, it's meant to be coming out pretty good, from what we're told here. But as for new predictions into the specifics of this big trailer release date, I've only really seen the estimate pop up connecting to this next Tuesday, as we're told from one of the news accounts covering the situation that, obviously nothing happened today, but next possible trailer release date is Tuesday, because gameplay trailer 1 was released on a Tuesday too. There simply isn't much more insight outside of the fact that one of the developers previously told us that there wasn't a plan for the whole thing that it would just end up popping up on us one day as a surprise. But following this trailer update, it turns out the official game itself is something we can start to piece together early based on what a developer recently revealed about Chapter 3. He gave us a little more information towards what we're meant to be seeing throughout the project. As we're told, we work really hard to keep things secret so there can be cool surprises for you guys when the games come out, and I don't want to have any chance of accidentally ruining that. Cluing us into these new sorts of secrets, meant to be revealed in Chapter 3's full release, that apparently have been hidden from the public this entire time. Outside of the secret characters recently hinted at by the CEO of the company, this would additionally include everything new that we're meant to see depicted in this big trailer as well. But along with this big post Mob Entertainment recently made for the Chapter 3 trailer, they also gave us new information towards the Smiling Critters. The fact we may end up seeing the big reveal tying to the show we've all been waiting for this whole time is outside of what the CEO ended up revealing to us, we were given new details regarding their scrap designs that, now more than ever, seems like they could be making a reappearance in a future Smiling Critters episode after all. 
You see, Mob Entertainment originally started slowly giving us house designs for the critters that never ended up making an official appearance in the VHS video, only to have even more behind the scenes tying to what they revealed earlier on. The fact that there was meant to be an entirely different opening to the Smiling Critters VHS originally, which connected to this new post tying everything together for us. They told us that in the meantime, before this big gameplay trailer announcement, that we should check out this unused art of the Smiling Critters houses that we saw depictions of previously, asking us which one we would like to live in. But the image itself, interestingly enough, is where our story surrounding the Smiling Critters gets interesting, as it connects directly to the big statement already made by the CEO of the company. You see, ever since the big launch of the VHS video, many members of the Poppy Playtime fanbase have rallied together in support of new episodes featuring the Critters. New videos following this original release that could be turned into a sort of ongoing show. And we know more definitively that, for starters, it's likely we won't be seeing anything new in regards to a new cartoon in the physical game, at the very least. We were already clued into the actual process behind the scenes, which let us know that it took the team a long time just to get this first cartoon VHS done. In terms of making a new depiction and having it fully complete by Chapter 3's release, it just doesn't seem possible. But it turns out after Chapter 3, there's more evidence than you might think that these new pictures and behind the scenes could very well end up connecting to a brand new sort of show after all. See, the CEO of the company himself, while informing the official Poppy Playtime Discord server about the upcoming game trailer and release, ended up slipping in an interesting comment regarding the whole Smiling Critters situation. He essentially told us that we should be looking out for future cartoon episodes meant to take place further down the line, hinting at a sort of side project we'd see that would finally give the fanbase what they all wanted. The new Smiling Critters video following this original VHS that could very well follow this new sort of story set up by the show's behind the scenes work. More episodes showing us the characters and their own homes together in a sort of village-like area, as the first time around we only saw the entire group crammed into one critter's home, obviously the leader, Dog Days. But having these new concepts already laid out for us could be just what we need to kickstart these rumors we were recently given for new episodes to finally come. But outside of what was revealed early here, we also have the most important update of all, connecting to what we were told more recently about the Chapter 3 release date. Outside of the trailer release date, we know that the game itself coming out is a completely different story. For starters, this big information connecting the potential release date predictions brings us to around the 25th of the month, the 30th of the month, or the 31st. But considering what we were additionally told from developers as well as team members behind the game, we were able to put together more of an idea of what release date we should actually be looking at here. So I put together everything we know on the situation in this video right here. For the full story on what we're told on this release date, make sure to check it out.